You hungry? Let's take a trip. What's up, locals? It's your girl, AJ, from the Local Tourist Craze. And for today's recipe, we are going to make pumpkin pie dip. So, ingredients that you're gonna need. You're gonna need some ginger snaps. This is for later. I opened it because I love ginger snaps, so I had to eat some. Side note. You're gonna need some pumpkin, some cream cheese at room temperature, so this has been sitting out for a little bit of time. Some ground allspice, some ground ginger, confectionery sugar or powdered sugar, and vanilla. And then utensils, you're gonna need a bowl, something to mix it with, and measuring spoons. So let's get into the video. All right, y'all, so what I did was I went ahead and took my room temperature cream cheese. Just in case you're wondering, I only have one glove and one hand because I cut my hand, so just get that out the way now. So can't nobody say, you only got one glove on, or whatever the case. Um, so you're gonna take your room temperature cream cheese and spread it out as much as you can. Um, and then you're gonna go ahead and add in about a tablespoon of vanilla. And you're gonna do a third of a cup of confectioner sugar. Now the reason why I'm adding in the sugar first cause it'll um, thin out your cream cheese just a little bit and that'll help. Oh guys, I forgot an ingredient. You're also gonna use um, some sour cream, but that's later. All right, so we're gonna go ahead and mix in. I'm gonna use a whisk to see if this helps. If you have a hand mixer, it'll make it even better, um, even easier. So we're gonna go ahead and incorporate all of this. So we got the confectioner sugar and cream cheese mixed in. Now we're gonna add in um, a third of a cup of sour cream. And this is just going to cut some of the sweetness as well as give it some creamy texture. And then you're also gonna do a cup of pumpkin puree. Turn it so y'all can see. Perfect. Now you're gonna incorporate all of that. And like I said, if you have a hand mixer, you can use a hand mixer, a spatula, whatever is comfortable for you. All right guys, so I got that all mixed up. I added a little bit of ginger. I'm gonna add in about a tablespoon of cinnamon. I forgot to tell y'all that too. Y'all know my brain be all over the place. But good thing is I put this on the below, so you'll know. And then I'm gonna add just a little dash of allspice. You don't wanna do too much because this can be, be real spicy. Um, so you're just gonna add in your spices. We're gonna mix this up. Um, I definitely would recommend the hand mixer. I think it'll make it a lot more smoother of a consistency. Um, we're actually working on investing new equipment for you guys so that all of the kitchen equipment will be nice and spanking new. So that's definitely coming soon. Um, just keep in mind we're in the middle of a pandemic and we're doing this on our own, y'all. So baby steps. So we're gonna mix our spices in. I'm gonna transfer this to the serving bowl. Actually, before you transfer, you can either do it before or after. You're going to refrigerate this for about 15 minutes so it can stiffen up a little bit. And then you're just gonna serve it with your ginger snaps. So we're gonna let this cool out in the fridge and then I'll come back and show you once we have it all served up. Okay guys, so we have been sitting and letting the pumpkin pie dip sit in the fridge for about 20 minutes. Here's how I would serve it if I were serving you here in my home. Let's go ahead and take a taste. Um, you can just serve it in a cute little bowl with your cookie of choice. Like I told you, we're using ginger snaps over here. So let's get a little bit of the dip and let's see. It's good guys. The ginger snaps really finish it really well. I sprinkled a little bit more cinnamon on top. And it gives you a really great creamy pumpkin pie texture. Really, really good. I like it, I like it. 
All right, guys, try this at home and let me know if you like the pumpkin pie dip. See you soon, guys. Don't stay at Taurus. Become a local and hit that subscribe button. And make sure you spread the love by liking and sharing this video for more local Taurus cravings.